How's your cold, Saki? Maybe you shouldn't be walking around in your PJs. Right, I forgot. My fever hasn't fully gone down yet, so I should go back home. Sounds like a good idea. Let's reschedule our observatory trip from when it's next open to the public. Okay, that's not going to be for a while, but I'll just have to be patient. Hopefully the weather will be better then. If only the skies were always clear in our world. Like here. That's an idea. Guys! I have a suggestion. Maybe this could do in the meantime. Hmm? Ichiga, let's begin. Okay, just give me a moment. Now, which bag did I put the juice and cups in? Should I pour the juice into the cups and carry them over there? Oh, no need to trouble yourself. You let us take your place over, that's already very kind. I intend to join in, so let me help. I laid down mats on the floor. You even brought cushions. That looks very comfy. Uh, sorry for acting like we own the place. <laughs> That's fine. This is your sekai after all. Hmm, I'd like to lie down here. Ah, it's nice and snug. Here's some juice for you. I see you're getting all relaxed, Luca. <laughs> Want to join me? You can lie down next to me. Sorry to keep you waiting. I brought cookies and more juice. I'll put them down here. It looks like we're ready to start. Yes, do your thing, Hona. Welcome, everyone. Please enjoy the wonderful views of tonight's starry sky. Oh yeah, this is going to be so great! Saki, keep it down. But isn't it nicer when the audience gets hyped? Not at planetariums, no. Please look straight ahead at the northern sky. You will notice seven stars that appear brighter than all the others. They couldn't go to the observatory, so instead they came up with this planetarium make-believe. I think this is a lovely idea. Miku, I've been meaning to ask you, didn't you come to the rooftop when I was talking to Saki? So you noticed? I had a feeling you were watching. You didn't interrupt, because you sensed I could get her to open up, didn't you? Thank you. Huh. Nothing gets past you, Luca. And here, we have Regulus, a first magnitude star, which means it's among the brightest. Mm, I'm getting sleepy. Don't you fall asleep on us, Saki. Kona's voice is so gentle. It's like a lullaby. I can't help it. Seriously, girl. Why don't we take a break? Honami could also use it. She's been talking non-stop. I don't mind, but it seems that Saki needs a nap. Don't let her nap or she'll just keep on sleeping until morning. Come on, Saki, stay awake. Don't be so Spartan, Shio! No complaints. Go and wash your face. It'll wake you up. Or we could perform a song together. I'm sure that will energize you. Oh, yes! Performing under the starry sky. How wonderful. Yay! Let's do this! 
Which song are we going to do? Performing with Miku and Luca? Oh gosh! <laughs> Saki perked up already. When it's something she wants, she finds the extra energy. I'm also down for playing, though. Let's do it! Oh! But first... Can I just say something? Before I forget? Sure. Go on. So, um... This planetarium play and playing in a band with Miku and Luca make me so happy. Time spent with you all has been so wonderful. I hope we can keep doing things like this and make many great memories together. That's the plan. Everything will be okay now. No more anxiety, no more fears. I'll take my time and enjoy every day as it comes. Together with my friends.